Welcome to Minimum Viable SEO. What is it? Well, we've talked a little bit about how SEO is uh, a little bit complicated and can be very time consuming. In fact, some agencies just specialize in living their life in tools and spreadsheets and giving you the info. What I'm trying to teach you with Minimum Viable SEO is basically that you can kind of hack your way to make your content have more eyeballs through search by doing this method. It shouldn't really take a long time. And if you get in the practice of doing it just before you start creating the content, you have the most chance of maximizing your success. So we know that SEO is really, really important if you want to create content online that lives in an evergreen way. Equally, this minimum viable SEO method, it's about going beyond just making content and hitting publish. It's about leveling up your skills to make sure you can know your audience, plan your keywords, and then optimize that success of your content. So the problem with SEO is that most people don't give it a moment's thought because it's all too hard, all too complicated. But I'm suggesting that if you spend 10, 15 minutes on minimum viable SEO, before you create your content and just after you've had the idea for what you want to create, you can really maximize your success online. So this process, just to refresh you, it's in your membership. It's a three-step process and it basically starts with doing a keyword and content hypothesis doesn't have to take a long time. I've got a canvas to take you through that super, super quickly. Then you do some quick and dirty research using the free tools to just validate that those keywords are worth going for. And you capture that information in a canvas.